where he is recovering. A tragic accident in the San Gabriel Valley. A man was hit and killed by an Azusa police motorcycle officer last night. KCAL 9's Tina Ezzedine has the latest on the investigation and what we know now about the victim. The response was quick. Fire police agencies as a police officer lay on the sidewalk. Just a few moments before, the officer on his motorcycle hit a pedestrian, killing him. People do jaywalk because there is an apartment right there, but that's not a reason for somebody to get killed. Nine o'clock last night, the officer with Azusa Police Department heading home after working his shift. The night would end with both the pedestrian and the officer taken to a hospital, but only the officer would survive. I'm just kind of saying he maybe had some discomfort, like in his shoulder, or some area, but. Yeah, he was up, uh, you know, active, uh, responsive. What we know so far is that the victim, only identified at this point as a 50 year old Asian male, was crossing Cienega Avenue when he was hit by the police officer's motorcycle. Pieces of the officer's motorcycle, a Honda, litter the street at the intersection of Cienega and Asherton Avenues near the city of Covina. His motorcycle still upright. The speed limit here, 35. It's unfortunate for the victim because we don't know the predicament of what happened, but why would he have gotten hit? Was the cop racing? Was he going too fast? How did he not see him? The investigation so far determining no evidence of alcohol or drug use. So why did a man lose his life? Why, just 15 minutes into his ride home, couldn't the officer stop in time? Questions still linger. Near Covina, Tina Ezzedine, KCAL 9 News. And now to this startling sight.